Welcome back everyone, and as you can see, we are already at the park. Yeah. Mary is doing the slide all by herself, and she's loving it. Like, I can't describe how much she's loving it, but I just really needed to get out of the house today. Some stuff has been going on, and I just need to get out, so. That's why we're all the way over here at this park, which really isn't close to us, but you know what? All is good. My hair is a little wacky today, but yeah, I don't really care right now. But the plan is after we play at the park, we are going to buy some sushi. And I'm not going to go into the sushi shop to actually eat there because there's no way I can deal with Mary by myself at the restaurants. So I'm going to get it to go. And we'll see how that goes because I've never ordered sushi to go before. And yeah, I hope it goes okay. But let's just enjoy some Mary fun time right now because she needs to get her energy out. <laughs> and we're going on the slide again. sushi place from the convenience store where I am parked because why not everybody needs a little exercise in their life and it's not that far of a walk and it's like why am I going to go through the hassle of putting Mary back in her car seat all of for all of two minutes just to take her all the way back out put her back in the carrier that I have her in and go into the sushi place. Yeah, I'm just gonna walk there. A lot less hassle. And it is super early. So, yeah.
And of course, the sushi place actually looks dead, like it's not even open. That can't be right because these sushi places are open like all day. Of course, they have their down times like any restaurant, but I really hope they're not closed. It's closed. Yay! Yeah, not good, Mary. No, no yay, that's not good. So, yeah, so much for the sushi idea. I wonder if there's another location I can go to. I'm not sure. Uh. That was a major bust. I don't know why they're closed right now because I can't read the kanji, but yeah. So I'm not even sure when they will open up again. Like they're not closed down for good. They would be quite stupid to be closed down for good because this particular location is always booming. Yeah. And maybe they're just remodeling or something. Who knows? But now I've got to figure out what I want to do for dinner. I was really in the mood for some sushi, but I didn't want to eat in a sushi restaurant. Of course, I can. O of course, I can always go to a supermarket and get sushi from a supermarket, but it's just not quite the same. And. But since that's been killed, now I don't know what I want. Yeah. It's very frustrating. Everybody has those days. They know what they want, and then they can't get it, and then it's just... What do you do after that? Like, there's not really ever a plan B, is there, for food? Yeah. At least I never make a plan B for food. Unless I'm like traveling somewhere and then I make a plan B because when you're traveling you really can't fathom like places and yeah. Oh Mary is still super hyper even though literally she was running up and down the hills for that slide and I don't know like I don't know how she does it but She's a child, full of energy. But I think what I'll end up doing is end up getting McDonald's for um, dinner. Chicken filet o setto. Chicken filet o setto. Ah. Yes. Potatoes to iced tea. Yes. Lemon or milk? Do you want to あのなし大丈夫なしではいとハッピーセットチェキンマクナゲットはいとポテトとソーケンピッチャーはいあのーニーバーンですはいあーソースはなしなしはいあ以上ですありがとうございます千百六十円ですお車前どうぞはいありがとうございますはい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、はい、は
one thing about the Happy Meals here, you get four different options, and usually there's like one like like toddler toy, I would say, which where it's just one piece kind of, and then there is an older toy where it has many parts to it and probably stickers that you have to put on it and like kind of build it and then they usually have some book options yeah books and this is one book option they have this time it's about hamsters and small animals and it's quite cool because it just it's like an information book like i just want to collect these for myself because i'm a big environmental science person but it's just like uh so cool you can like write a freaking report on something from information in these books pretty much and yeah they usually have one book like this and then they have another option book that is just kind of like a storybook and we got that last time and it was about a cat and it was really cute but of course it's all in japanese no english but it's just super cool that they do these things and I never had that option when I was a kid. It was just, you have one toy and you can't exchange it. You can exchange toys here. Like, and I'm pretty sure you can do it now in America. Like, oh, we already have this toy kind of thing. But all of the toys are wrapped in opaque bags so you can't see what's inside of them. So you literally have to feel it and be like, okay, yeah, we already have this toy, can we get a different one? And sometimes they can, sometimes. They don't have any other options but yeah and i'm like dude you have it so good here as a kid or even in america now because when i went to mcdonald's as a kid you were given a toy and there was no exchanges like period like the time they did beanie babies as the toys like i think at one time i had three of the same thing because you can't ex you couldn't exchange them for a different one and it was just like, ah, oh, I have this one already, but it's like, all oh, well. <laughs> but times change, I guess, and they want to please the customers more and more. But yeah, so I'm going to eat dinner now. <laughs> and then after that, I'm not sure what we're going to do. Probably just relax around and then I'll put Mary to bed. Well guys, it is time to put Mary to bed. And uh, as soon as I pulled out her like nighttime blanket thing that we put on her at night now, to just make sure she always has a blanket on her, she like automatically ran into the bedroom. Yeah, she's obviously sleepy, so let's just go to bed. Let's put this on. <laughs> Peekaboo! Peekaboo! Wow! Wow! Yeah! Wow! Wow! It is a little big on her, but that's okay. And it hasn't seemed to bother her lately, so I'm cool with that. Are you ready to say bye bye? Oh, good job. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night. Oyasumi. No? Okay, well, I'm going to go put her to bed, and then I'll be back. Bye -bye. Mary is all asleep, and is it just me, or, like, does anybody else still get scared of SIDS with their tiny little toddlers? I know she's almost two now, and out of the danger of having SIDS but like she has such shallow breathing I literally almost have to wake her up sometimes to make sure she's still alive like, I'm like is she breathing and I like put my hand over her nose and mouth to see if she's breathing now and I like lick my hand so I can feel the breath and I still can't feel anything and then I have to shine a light on her to see her chest going up and down because that's just how shallow her breathing gets when she goes to sleep and I'm always scared but yeah I don't know when that fear will go away it should already be gone by now right she's almost two but 
whatever so i am going to edit a video tonight and then i think i will just relax so i'll see you in my next one bye